And welcome back guys, I'm your host Keyblade Carry 2010 How you doing today, you beautiful souls? I'm doing fantastic myself. Alright, so we are jumping into our next Let's Play, which is going to be Persona 5 Royal Edition. Viewer discretion is advised. This gameplay is rated M for Mature. If you're under the age of 17, you probably should not be watching this. This does contain quite a bit of gore, quite a bit of violence, and some heavy topics as well. If you are triggered by any of these things, please click away right now, but feel free to check out my rated E for everyone games and my rated T for teen games. Those ones are a little bit more for everybody. I also have other playlists. I do more than just video games, so if you are interested, check out my playlists over there. So, but if you're okay with this, then let's dive into our wonderful world of Phantom Thieves. So sit back, relax, and enjoy Persona 5 Royal Edition. You have been warned. Be careful, I might just steal your heart next. <laughs> Alright guys, we are continuing on from where we last left off because of the fact that I couldn't continue on uh, because we ran out of time, massively. Alright! Okay, let's find the control room quickly. The path's gonna close up if we dig- or if we dig around. Oh, <laughs> I got the thing turned on. But it's just gonna be me and you for a bit if we- if we run into any enemies, you good? Yeah. I'm worried. Like, I'm a bit worried. So. <laughs> Damn it. Alrighty. Hey, what do you want to do? We have to go hey. through. We got this. We can do this. Sorry. Yo, you're gonna let us through right now. Hmm. Who are you? I see the editor. You must be the thieves who Dear, dear Lord Madarame. Or Threat. I think that's what it was. There we go. Okay. I'm pretty sure we should be okay. I do have a powerful. They got past the security system? You cannot go any further. You are trespassing on Lord Madarame's territory. You guys ain't got nothing on us. I'm more scared of screwing up and having on yell at me. Yeah. Persona! I have uh, my strong persona, so we're just gonna end this real quick. Yeah! We'll see. Yeah, thought so. I felt like you're a mini boss. I'm not taking any chances with you, dude. Uh, things are uh, really tough when it's just you and me. Not really, but okay. It'll be a pain in the ass if we get spotted again. Anyways, let's turn off the security system. I think that's back here, if anything. Takamaki-san, this is bad. Are these the lights? Huh? What the? Isn't this Sayuri? Why are there so many of them? I have no idea. Get out! Sensei, what is the meaning of this? I suppose I can't keep quiet now that you've seen this. Truth be told, I'm in severe debt. I handmade these Sayuri copies and have been selling them through a special connection of mine. But why? The real Sayuri was stolen by one of my pupils long ago. I assume they begrudged my strictness. That moment was quite a shock for me. Since then, I've been mired in a terrible artist block. Because of this distress, 
Some of my pupils handed their ideas over to me from time to time. Uh. I knew I couldn't keep that up, so I attempted to recreate the Sayuri a number of times. However, it resulted in nothing more than replicas. That's when someone came to buy the paintings, knowing, well, they weren't original. It's all my fault. I couldn't pay the price of being famous. As expectations for me rose, it reached a point where I had no choice but to keep making them. I needed money to further your talents. I ask that you please forgive your cowardly teacher. Please, don't. Hold on, something doesn't add up. If the original painting got stolen, how did you make copies of it? I happened to find a finely detailed photograph of it in an art book. So you managed to sell copies of a photo of the original? I'm not sure how this works, but don't people who buy paintings generally have a keen eye for the fine arts? Yeah. Mm, this sounds like a lie to me. What would you know? Something just doesn't feel right. Lady On! This one seems different. Sayuri? This... This is the real Sayuri. But you just said a moment ago that it was stolen. That's a replica! No! It's nothing of the sort! This painting kept me going. It's the reason I made it this far. Sensei... Don't tell me. It's fake. Yes, a counterfeit. I heard there was a counterfeit spreading around, so I bought it. So you're telling me the actual artist behind the painting bought a counterfeit? That's pushing it. You're lying, Sensei. Please, just tell us the truth. You too? I've reported you to my private security company. What? I had it set up to deal with some problematic paparazzi, but I never thought it'd come in so handy. Uh -oh. Please, wait. Let's talk about this. You can talk all you want to the police. That includes you, Yusuke. Lady On, let's run! A cat? Where did it... There's no point! They'll be here within two minutes! Takamaki-san! Yeah, let's go! Well, let's hurry up and get that uh, shit shut off. Oh my goodness, is it this one? Can we get in here? We can. Hey, look! Hey, this time, uh... uh yeah, this is the... Yep. So which one for the security? Well, we're gonna start poking around until we actually uh, hit something. But that's... Oh yeah, definitely. Um, I don't know, maybe it's the computer that's like, on? Alright! Sweet! Now the losers and the... Should be off... Uh, off for good. Well, that's mission complete. Come on, let's uh, get out of here. Um, yeah, no. Everything happens so fast. Like, holy cow. I feel bad for Yusuke. I really do entirely. Hey, who's there? Whoa! Crap, let's make a run for it. I think that's a statue of him. <laughs> Perfect. All right. All right. Let, uh, looks like the security totally uh, or is totally off. Let's go back and meet up with the others. I hope those two manage to get away. Yeah. <laughs> I put the sign on for a reason. Don't mess with that painting, it's wet. Yeah, don't mess with it, leave it. Okay. 
Wanna make us some lunch? Wanna make us some lunch? Oh no, something. Just pick something. Sure. Put some uh put some of my um chicken in it. My patties, my chicken patties. Okay, make sure you don't set off the alarm. Oh yeah, you're gonna have to microwave them because I haven't cleaned up the... Yeah, that's all right. Anyways, I hope these two manage to... Uh, or hope those two manage to get away. No! Uh-oh. <clears throat> oh, he caught her. Good caught. Good catch, dude. Oh! oh. <laughs> My god. Oh my god, I got him in ah, oh, oh. I thought I was gonna die! Uh, hey! Uh, will you let go already? <coughs> oh no! I didn't mean to push him so hard! Are you okay? Wake up! Who are you all? You knocked him out cold. Uh, calm down, Kitagawa-kun! It's me! Kamaki-san, that means you two are... I don't recall ever seeing this cat costume before, though. What is this place? We are inside Matarame's heart. Inside Sensei's heart? I'm sorry, Takamaki-san, but are you sure you're feeling okay? She ain't lying. This is what that bastard truly feels. He's nothing but a greed-filled money grubber. Enough of this rubbish! Kitagawa-kun, didn't it cross your mind that something wasn't right about Matarame? <sighs> That's... Uh... You may not want to believe it, but this is another reality as viewed through Matarame's eyes. This is his true nature. This repulsive world? Just who are all of you? I guess you could say... We're a group that changes the hearts of Ron Crooks. If everything you say is true, then the sensei I know doesn't exist. You gotta snap out of it. Still, he has kept me safe these past ten years. My gratitude for that won't just disappear. You're gonna forgive him? At this rate, you'll... Are you okay? I'm trying to be rational about this, but my emotions are overwhelming me. Sorry, but we don't have time to dawdle. The security level's gone through the roof. We need to get out of here at once. <sighs> oh, my goodness. Here, lend me your shoulder. No, it's all right. You sure? Good dude. We need to get out of here. That said, we have an amateur with us now. Let's try to avoid fighting as much as possible. I could try, but I highly doubt that we will. Oh yeah, we just, I think we just teleport. Yeah, we just teleport to the main uh, section here. So this is inside of Sensei's heart? A vain museum such as this? Unfortunately, it is. It's. It, I remember seeing the hard, harsh truth of things in my life too, and I'm all like, "This can't be real. This, this person I, I used to care about. This person used to care about me." Uh, this painting. Do you recognize it? We were thinking these might be his past pupils or something. But why are the paintings of them here? Technically, those aren't actually paintings. They're the pupils themselves. Madarame saw as objects, so that's what they are in here. Oh, and, uh, we found yours, too. <sighs> we'll talk more later. For now, let's get out of here. But yeah, it's, it's tough to face reality on some things, and it can be very o over... Overwhelming and emotional and all that, and even to the point where it makes you sick to your soul. Been there, done that. The exit is right there! <laughs> oh, you bastard. Who is it? What the? <laughs> Talk about bullshit clothes. First a king, now some kind of shogun. 
Welcome to the museum of the master artist, Madarame! Huh? Sensei? Is that you? That... attire? Disgusting! This... this is all one big lie, isn't it? My usual ragged attire is nothing but an act. Besides a famous person living in that shack, I have another home. Under a mistress's name, of course. Are you kidding? You stole somebody's last name as well? I'm almost impressed. <laughs> How naive! the Sayuri was stolen, why was it in the storage room? And if you had the real one, why make copies? If it's really you, Sensei, please tell me. Foolish child, you still don't see? Painting being stolen was just a false rumor I spread. It was all a perfectly calculated staging. What do you mean? Let me see. How does this sound? I found the real painting, but it can't go public. You can have it for a special price, though. Ha <laughs> ha! How's that for preferential treatment? So you have Art the snobs will eat it up and pay good cash at that! Oh my god. No. The value of art is purely illusion. What's the matter with providing that illusion to eager customers? Though I doubt a brat like you would ever come up with such a brilliant scheme. You keep going on and on about money this, money that. No wonder you ended up with this disgusting museum. You're supposed to be an artist, right? Aren't you ashamed of plagiarizing other people's work? Art is nothing but a tool. A tool to gain money and fame. You help me greatly as well, Yusuke. God, it pisses me off. That's your teacher. But what about the people who believe in you? Who think you're a master artist? I'll tell you this alone, Yusuke. If you wish to succeed in this world, I'd advise you don't rise against me. Do you believe anyone could find success with my objection holding them down? <laughs> I was under the care of this wretched man. You thought I took you in out of the goodness in my heart? Plucking talented yet troubled artists allows me to find promising pupils and take their ideas. That's disgusting. After all, it's much easier to steal the futures of children who can't fight back. I can't believe this. Livestock are killed for their hide and meat. This is no different, you fool. But I tire of this little chat. It's time that I... You are unforgivable. Mm. It doesn't matter who you are. I won't forgive you. So, you repay my keeping you around for all these years with ingratitude? You damn brat! Men, dispose of these thieves! Oh boy, here we go. Get back! How amusing. Huh? <laughs> it seems the truth is stranger than fiction, huh? Kitagawa-kun? I wanted to believe it wasn't true. I had clouded my vision for so long. My eyes were truly blind. Life and unable to see the true self behind this one horrible man. Uh oh, is he awakening? Have you finally come to your senses? Here we go. <gasps> How foolishly you averted your eyes from the truth. A deplorable imitation indeed. Best you part from that aspect of yourself. Let us now forge a contract. 
I am thou. Thou art I. The world is filled with both beauty and vice. It is time you teach people which is which. Very well. Come. Go am on! A breathtaking sight. Imitations they may be, but together they make a fine spectacle. Though the flowers of evil blossom, be it known, abominations are fated to perish! Whoa, this is impressive! <laughs> Who do you think you are? The price for your insolence will be death! Where are my guards? Kill them all! The children who adored you as father. The prospects of your pupils. How many did you trample upon? How many dreams did you exchange for riches? No matter what it takes, I will bring you to justice! Let's see what you're made of, kiddo. Very well, bring it on! <laughs> Presence of Lord Marwame! On your knees, intruders! I learned much from you, Marwame. In order to see authenticity, one must be dispassionately realistic. With Goemon by my side, I can now ascertain your true self without any reservations. Let's go! This right. is my other self! So, let's go! Goemon! Do Persona! I thought it was his weakness. I'm not actually gonna do Persona because I wanna see uh want you guys to see some of their stuff. But I am pretty powerful. <laughs> I might put some of these guys on automatic. Try to get your stuff going out there. Yeah, well, we'll see how long that lasts for you. There we go. Just thrown your bright future down the drain. No, if anything, he like stuck up to you, and now all the other pupils are gonna be like everything that you've said about them is going to be gone entirely. So, no, I'm doing a good thing for the world. Scum like you should not exist in this world, even in the real world. Like, seriously, it's sad, but it's a thing. I'll destroy every chance you've ever had of becoming an artist! Matarame! You'll forever rue the day you dared defy me! Get back here! Kitagawa-kun! Why can't I move? Listen, you're totally drained. You can't do much even if you wanted to. What a disgrace I am. Come on, just listen to her. You've known for quite some time, haven't you? I'm no fool. Strange people have been coming by for years. And the plagiarism was an everyday affair. But... Who would want to admit that the man they owed their life to was doing such terrible things? Why didn't you leave, Kitagawa-kun? Well, he is the one who painted the Sayori. On top of that, I owe him a great debt. You mean because he raised you? I never knew my father. I was told my mother raised me by herself, but she died in an accident when I was three. 
That's when Sensei took me in. I heard he helped my mother while she was still alive. Heard? To be honest, I don't remember much about my mother either. I did everything I could for Sensei. I thought of him as a father. But he changed. To think he would treat the Sayori, the very foundation of his art, like that. A lot's happened to you, huh? When you had mentioned plagiarism, deep down, I knew you were right. That's why I so vehemently denied you. I was simply running from the truth. I'm sorry. Yeah, I understand, man. I'm grateful for the chance to face what I've been denying all this time. You're way too serious, man. That's why you're always getting stuck in your own head. Look at me. I just go with the flow. For real. <laughs> what are you going to do now? I don't know. We can't help the fact that Madarame's gone and changed. But we can change his heart. We'll make him pay for his crimes. That reminds me. You mentioned something about that change of heart earlier. Have you heard the rumors? The ones about the phantom thieves that steal hearts? <laughs> Don't tell me. We gotta go. Oh crap! We'll talk later. We need to scram! When did my clothes change? You just noticed that now? I was gonna say. Save it for after. Let's go! I see. And because of that, this P.E. teacher's had a change of heart. The phantom thieves who steal hearts. To think they truly exist. Right in front of you, is it hard, is it hard to believe? No, I believe you. There's no need for common sense to blind me after seeing a world like that. So, your plan with Madarame-sensei? With Madarame? is to force a change of heart, correct? Yes. Let me join, as a member of the Phantom Thieves. Had I faced reality sooner, this may have been avoided. I must put an end to this, for the sake of the others whose futures as artists were robbed as well. That is the most civil thing I can do for the man who was, in some manner, my father. Civil, huh? Sounds fine to me. We're gonna deal with Madarame anyways. He may have a mental shutdown if we screw up. We have ways to prevent that, but they aren't fail-safe. Remember how we mentioned this on our way here? Madarame is a man who has the art world under his thumb. He has connections to many organizations. If someone like me raises my voice, it'll only be snubbed out. We have no option but this. Yep. Kitagawa-kun? It's a deal, then. We have a new member in the Phantom Thieves now. I hope we get along, Yusuke. You better not slow us down. I'll do my best. Seriously, keep it down. You're supposed to be secretive and whatnot, but you guys are, like, blabbing. Like, there's not... There's, like, people behind you and whatnot. Thank you. I ask that you coach me well. Oh, that reminds me. I wonder what's going on with the real Madarame. Yusuke and I were in a pretty tight situation. Actually, I contacted him before we came here. He believes that I continued pursuing Takamaki-san. And, just as you all explained, it appears he knows nothing about his shadow. What did he say? He was complaining to the security company how they couldn't even catch one high school girl. However, he's still furious about it, and said that he's going to take legal action against everyone. Talk about being completely on guard. Legal action? He's acting way too desperate. Maybe he still has more secrets. If he were to act, it'd be after the exhibit is over. Any scandal during the show would be his loss. Right when 
I think the talk about being a nude model is over, this happens? We'll have to force a change of heart before then, if we're to dodge this legal action thing. Looks like our plan must be accomplished while the exhibit is still open. Yep. By the way, what is this? Huh? A cat. But it's talking. You have a problem with that? No, not really. Why not? He's just on a different wavelength than other people. Do you wish to draw me? You better bring out the best of me in that case. No. Hmm. Hey, don't touch me like... I was thinking of ordering some black bean jelly. I bet he got that idea from a black cat. Oh! I didn't bring any money. Never mind. He's just weird. <laughs> so we got a new member to our team. Hey. I hope you're not up to no good. Don't forget, you're still under... And, uh, get, got it? One me um, mistake and you're finished. No good. No, no, What's no. What's wrong uh, What's wrong about changing the heart been. of crime or criminals? We don't. Or we're doing I'm the right thing. Oh my goodness. Okay, some more. Uh, legal action. This ain't funny. So, yeah, no duh. Uh, if the police hear about this, they'll totally get in touch with the school. We'll be, or we'll get expo or expelled for sudden, for sure this time. School would be the last of our, least of our worries. We'd end up, uh, Please don't take off my entrance. Entrance. Uh, Guess that means we're really, we really can't afford to f, f it up this time. Yeah, for here, from here on out is what really matters. Let's do it. We just need to change his heart before he presses charges. Try to focus on that problem for now. We'll get to the top uh, beforehand. No, don't worry about it. Trust me. We have 17 Nothing days. Uh, what are we on time-wise? Uh, can I go anywhere else? No, but I do have... Hey! Really? This is another thing I hate about this game, too. Um... We'll be able to do it in 17 days. Like I said, I always push to get to the top of the tower anyways beforehand. Let's do it. And what not. No, Madarama is like a scum. Entire scum. Like, oh my god. Excuse me. But, uh... I think I'm gonna call it good for today's episode. I know this one's gonna be a little bit shorter than I usually do. I am trying to get as many videos done um, because I am going to a convention here in the next uh, two weeks or so. So uh, I'm gonna try and uh, push for as many videos as I can and work on prop work because I'm currently working on my husband's uh, keyblade right now and painting that right now. I've got a like a bunch of paint here and there on my hands. Actually, the sweat <laughs> from my fingers uh, wash it off apparently. So, but uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for all the support and love. If you're new to the channel and you like what you see, please smash that subscribe button, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment down below. Definitely hit that notification bell so you get notified when I upload ch to the channel and when I go live. I usually try and go live every Saturday, but the next two or next couple Saturdays, unfortunately. I will not be going live whatsoever because of the fact that uh, I'll be leaving soon and all that. So uh, you'll be just getting a video like this uh, on days that I don't, uh, that I have stuff going on. 
and I hope that's okay with you. Sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't, but uh, real life comes first, you know. Um, also down in the description box down below, if you'd be so kind to click on that link tree, it'll take you to a page that has my Discord, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and a bunch of other things as well if you want to support. Uh, it's down below there, all in one little website, and you don't have to go hunting down all my um, information. It's all right there for you guys. Also, if you're just here to check out what the channel is all about and whatnot, thank you for uh, clicking on the video. I appreciate it. And uh, just so you know, I do more than just video games on my channel. And you might find something on here that you might like that uh, you might be possibly interested in other than video game stuff. So that is it for today's episode. Thank you guys so much for all the support and love. Keyblade Kyrie 2010 signing out. Game on gamers, cosplaying cosplayers. Be safe, everybody. I love you guys. Bye! <laughs>